It's the night before the Christmas concert. May I sit in the middle? Can I put that one down there for now? For Fred and Ken, there's just one last job to do. Wrap the children's Christmas presents. Do you think the children appreciate Christmas as much as we did? Well, they expect more presents, let's put it that yeah, way. Yeah, and expensive ones. Well, what about when, when you were young? My first Christmas in America. In America? Yeah, yeah, when we... Well, what were you doing in America? We were evacuated out during the war. I was six when the war started. Dad worked for Kodak. Anybody working for Kodak could send their children to America for the duration of the war. People who worked for Kodak over there volunteered to look after Kodak kids, which is what we were called, Kodak kids. The first Christmas we had in America, uh, we, had, we received everything that you could possibly want as a child. Although you missed your mum and dad, you, you sort of got used to having adopted parents. And Kodak used to put on a party for the children. And whilst we were having the party, they would film us at the party. Then they would take that film and show the parents us at the party. And have a party for the parents and um, would film that and show us. So you still, and they would have messages on there from the parents to us. So you, you still felt that you were in touch with your parents and of course the letters as well. We were over there for five years, so I was 11 when, when we came back. My first Christmas back, it was, it was good because um, we were back as a family. Do you think they'll appreciate these, the effort that's gone into it? I think they're going to be blown out of the mind. <laughs> <laughs> this morning in the nursery, a special surprise has been planned. In celebration of Lark Hill's oldest resident, Sylvia, as she approaches her 103rd birthday in two weeks' time. <laughs> and the same to you, Ken. With everyone back together, it's the perfect time to celebrate. Your next birthday, how old will you be? Oh dear, a gentleman shouldn't ask a lady that. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> oh dear, it's wonderful, thank you. There is almost 100 years between the children and Sylvia. Reaching 103 is a phenomenal achievement. She enjoys life, and we've seen how much she enjoys being part of this experiment. Oh, gosh. Oh, what a lovely... Oh, dear. <gasps> oh, it looks so amazing. Happy birthday, Sylvia. Oh, Happy birthday. Oh, Do you want to make a birthday wish? I, I wish, I wish that all these lovely children, I will see them every day because it's so lovely. Happy birthday! <laughs> You're lovely, Sylvia. <laughs> One, two, two three, three, seven. Hooray! 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 Well it's wonderful that people have done all this. I could cry. <laughs>